over 200 years ago. An affluent captain set sail to the world, seeking new horizons and shores, leaving behind a hidden fortune no man has discovered. Now, today, four men with similar ambitions seek to find his fortune. An elusive treasure absent to time and history. Hello there. This story begins three days ago. I was in my attic looking for some boat shoes when I came across something truly significant. At first, I couldn't believe my eyes. I looked again. I then realized this was my call to adventure. But any adventure needs a team. Howdy, G. I'm Sunny. I think we're off to a bit of a rough start. Um, everyone's coming together a bit more, which is great. Sonny's uh, stopped scaring the hell out of Marcus, and I think that's definitely a step in the right direction. Yeah, um, to be honest, don't have a lot of faith in our associates here. Um, I feel that we're probably straying further from our current objective, and also being in a confined metal death trap with these others is a, a real trial by fire. Yeah, I think we went in there a little bit too optimistic. Maps says it was somewhere in this kind of... Trail. I say we go uphill. No, I think we're supposed to go downhill. Uphill. Downhill. We're going with the brains. Downhill. Let's do it. It's actually left behind in this notes by James Cook. It seems to be leading us to somewhere in this general vicinity. Um, the coordinates here are not too far out where we are at the moment, but... I don't have higher hopes that we're not going to get lost. Sometimes you gotta look after your group. Yo! You're so yo, well, yo, yo, so yo, 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 why aren't we looking for the treasure? Because the camera guy has to take his scenic shots. Why are we looking for scenic shots? I came in to look for scenic shots! Whoa, 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 put the gun down! What does the note say? Okay, the note says, at this point, you will see three rocks of equal identity. Well, these are the coordinates. I see three rocks, but they're not equal. Coastal erosion. You see, this note would have been written in the 1700s. The landform would have changed since then. But Genius. the tide... The tide's coming in. Let's go, let's go! I hate climbing, yeah. The only real climbing I do is usually on the property ladder. That rock was easy. But Marcus, 
Needs a bit slow. I felt like we were getting pretty close. A toast to us, <laughs> but now for the clue. It's a map. Oh, that's Ohiwa Bay. That's East Coast. That's my home. Hey, look at the TV. Aaron, what time do you get off today? <clears throat> Our top story tonight. Local Ohiwa Bay resident finds a missing piece of Captain James Cook's lost treasure map. Our reporters ask, where did he find it? So I went hiking with my granddad one day and we came across this. Gee, that's next to Ulysses' house. I decided to keep it at my place, 14 Arbor Road. Or we obey. And I hope no one steals it. <laughs> Coming up next, my failed love life. We need that clue! And there's only one way to get it. It's a high risk, I might add. Well, hang on, hang on. Are we sure about this? Is it worth it? Well, if it's for the treasure, I'm in. Can you take us there? Boys, I know the house. Okay, we have to wait for our cue. You ready? Let's go. Alright, that's it, let's go. Uh, hi, um, we're here to check on your roof. Yeah, we're with the council. I fell in love with that house. Beautiful architecture. Uh, yes, I'm, I'm Mr. Laeta. And I'm Bold. Yes. Laeta Bold. Yes, sir. Yes, um, yeah, we just had a look at you. Hold up, I'm gonna go and check my stove. Okay. Wait, we'll be right here. We need to get him back somehow. No, um, excuse me. Uh, hi. <laughs> so, uh, we're with the council. They've asked us to do. Yeah, you just give it a little. Yeah, right now, we just want to. We just want to. Hey, hey, hey! Just, uh, make sure that everything is fine. Yeah, it's, it's all good. Yeah, just make sure. Yeah, that... Oh, right. We gotta fit through. Oh, no, it's all right. We'll just check it. We'll just check it. We just look. After retrieving the third clue, we ran into a small problem. Well, the third map had no markings on it. No X's, no coordinates. We had no direction. We were lost. What do we do now? There's not much we really can do. Give me another look at these. Guys, I owe you all an apology. <laughs> it was my idea in the first place to go on this stupid trip. If I didn't look for my boat shoes, we wouldn't have ended up here. Well, did you find them? What? Yeah, did you find your boat shoes, G? No, why, why do you even care? Well, you bought the muffler. Like it was important. Yeah, my boy, my shoes! My point is, my shoes! 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 Look, we missed something. Look at this, all of these points, they all lead up to the same place. Look, this, this clue here would have led us to this one. And this one has the same markings on it. And if we put them together, they lead to there. Where is that? It's Mount Edgecombe.
my body's not built for climbing mountains. It's built for property investment. You know, at the start of the climb, I was pretty confident. But we got up two hours in. Oh, mate, that was pretty tight, eh? Oh, crap. Oh, my legs, eh? Oh, big thighs, eh? Yeah. Ooh. Everything was going great. Then all of a sudden, we lost Brian. Where's Brian? Uh. Brian! Hey, 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 buddy. Hey. Uh. We're walking the path of James Cook. I know. Let's go. Now before we go into the crater, I just want to say it's been a pleasure working with you guys. <laughs> You've done well, Brains. It's good on you. Yeah, you too, big guy. Don't get too friendly. <gasps> so it's down there? It appears so. Uh, you know, I wonder how people are going to react to us coming into this large amount of wealth. In the end, we all seemed to get what we wanted. Marcus got himself into some sort of rocket company. Marcus. Oh, Elon. How are we? Yeah, look, sorry, do you mind just wanting to... Can someone bring me a coffee, please? Yeah, no, look, um, so when are we booking that um, penthouse on Mars? And Sonny, he managed to get that house he always wanted. And Tony bought one of the biggest gyms in Southwest Royal Oak. Hey, I said if you love it so much, why don't you marry it? So I bought myself a gym. Tony Martin's gym. And then there's me. With all of that money, I decided to, to buy myself a new pair of boat shoes. But it wasn't over for me. I was waiting, waiting for something more.